This ambulance was totally destroyed, but luckily, the crew and a patient inside involved in the crash on a snowy Trans-Canada highway appear to have suffered no serious injuries. The EMT pinned behind the wheel was the one who made the first call to 911, while the paramedic in the back was bounced about while tending to the patient. Neither were seriously injured. Uh, the driver of the snowplow was uh, initially talked to and assessed on scene and was not transported to the hospital. Neither the EMT behind the wheel nor the paramedic in the back of the ambulance were seriously injured in the crash. Neither was the fellow who was driving the snowplow. The patient who was in the back of the ambulance might have even been unaware that he was in a crash. He's not said to have been injured in the mishap and was later listed in stable condition. A number of issues worked in the favour of this crew, including the fact that an off-duty doctor from Edmonton was one of the first on scene, as well as off-duty fire crews. Yeah, when, when our crews turned up on scene, they had already um, attended to the EMS and the patient that was already in the back of the unit. They had got them out and they were already giving care when we arrived. It is believed that wintry conditions and possibly poor visibility led to this crash. Reporting for Sun News, this is Nadia Moharab.